Hello, my name is Ruth Carter and I'm a licensed attorney in Arizona. And this is your question of the day. So, somebody asked me, I have a question about using client testimonials and what constitutes as their permission to use it. Do I need a specific form for them to fill out? And if so, what should it include? Or is a simple written email from them saying, yes, you can use this on your website and social media sufficient? All right. So if I were in this person's shoes and I got a testimonial from a client, um, I would probably ask um, if I can use uh, what they said on my website. Um, one, I'm a risk adverse lawyer and it looks really bad when the internet lawyer screws up. Um, and two, people do have the right to their publicity. So if they don't want to be publicly endorsing you, that is their prerogative. So uh, if you don't have like a specific form that you have them fill out, um, like at the end of the um, customer company relationship for them to to provide feedback back testimonials, um, then yeah, I would just ask and just um, and probably a simple email is sufficient. So in the event that it's ever challenged, you at least have documentation that you had permission to uh, to use what that person said. So um, I think that's all I have on this one. I would check with your profession to see if there are rules about testimonials and do's and don'ts. Um, but in general, um, getting permission, preferably in writing, should be sufficient. Um, for your needs. So um, I also know that other companies, instead of soliciting testimonials and asking what um, to put on their website, they ask you to do reviews on like Google reviews or Yelp or things like that. And so it's up to them to, to do it. Um, and if they choose to do it, great. If not, that's their prerogative. So I would look at the totality of the circumstances and your overall goal uh, to help you determine what's right for you. Uh, I hope this has been helpful for you. If you're hearing weird noises in the background, it's because my dog is in my office today and she's chomping on uh, one of her toys. Um, but maybe the microphone didn't pick that up. Um, yeah, I want to thank whoever asked me this question. You can always leave questions for me to answer in future videos below or shoot me an email. And of course, watching this video does not create an attorney-client relationship with any viewer. It's merely legal information, not legal advice. If you need legal advice, go hire somebody. I put out new content every week, so please subscribe to the channel. And until then, I will catch up with you later. Take care.